Well, hello and welcome to a new video. Uh, I'm in the studio. I've just set up for a sitter session and I thought I would open up some AliExpress packages. I have a whole bag full of packages. I think there are like five or six packages and most of them are dresses, which I can use during maternity sessions. Lots of packages. Um, super excited to see what's inside. So let's uh, open a package. So this one actually includes two dresses. It says maternity jeans. Description of contents. Maternity jeans, they're definitely not jeans. Uh, khaki, size L. Mm -mm, that's not what I ordered, doesn't matter. I put the screenshot of what I ordered in the screen. It says value US dollars, $23. I think that's about right. Two pieces inside. Here you can see the colors. One is light purple and one is kind of yellowish. Sorry for all this crunchy sounds. Okay, so here we've got one dress. As you can see, it's a dress with long sleeves, uh, lace, and then in the bottom, uh, also some mermaid tail lace. Um, there's like lining inside for the breast area and then up until the knee area, I think. So now I just have to see if I'm gonna have something underneath my tank top to pretend being pregnant. A balloon. This just looks horrible. <laughs> anyway, okay, so let's try on some dresses. Okay, yeah, so normally I would have a different bra underneath like probably like a strapless bra um, and now I have straps because I'm just wearing like a tank top otherwise my belly doesn't stay in place here we go I'm just gonna put that the camera a little bit higher okay so this is what it looks like it's quite pretty I love that it's long enough I love the lace long sleeves off shoulder the belly Okay, I have the weirdest belly ever, sorry. Um, but I think it looks quite pretty. So here you can see it up close. Yeah, of course you can see wrinkles. Okay, <laughs> especially with a belly like this. I think it looks quite good. And here we have the light yellow one. And it is the same. Ooh, there's some plastic stuck to it. Um, no, it's a different model as well. This one has more like a train in the back and it has sleeves it has a boost area but it's not like tight here it's just like loose and then like with the train i'm changing up my uh, balloon for just a piece of fabric because it feels more natural i think it looks better as well kind of like mold it okay so here we've got the pregnant belly um size large this one has a little train um some kind of weird Cap sleeves. Let's see if that goes well. Ooh, you might have to help your pregnant ladies into these dresses because this one is, for example, a tiny bit complicated. Belly and dress. Okay, so this one is kind of like a light yellow. <gasps> Very pretty. I thought it would be short, but it's actually hitting the floor perfectly, even with the big belly. And it has the train. I don't know if you can see. It's so hard to film horizontal when you are a vertical person trying to show off a dress. So hopefully now you can see the bottom. So here you see my feet peeking underneath. I can bend my knee, hold one hand here. Have this off shoulder sleeve, belly, beautiful belly. Uh, and it has like a little train, so yeah. You have to help, of course, get their train in a good position when you're alone, it's a little bit harder. So yeah, I think it's a very pretty dress for a maternity session. Can't wait to use it during a real session. Uh, I'm like out of breath. Second package. Uh, description of content, dress. Value, $2. That's not right, but um, good for tax purposes. So yeah. I'm a big fan of like neutral tones because they look good on most women and doesn't matter if you're expecting a boy or a girl 
um, especially with these like light colored backgrounds, it looks really pretty. So this one is also this off-white, light yellow almost. Okay, so here we also have something lace. It kind of looks similar like the other one. Okay, so here we go. So this is just short sleeves and it's kind of like this old fashioned dress. I think it, it's just like too short for me, but I'm pretty tall. I'm like five foot nine. I don't know if that's correct. I'll put it in the screen. I'm like, I'm one meter and 77 centimeters pretty much. So here you go, this is the dress. What do you think? Do you like my maternity gown? Okay, so again, it's too short. You can see my feet, but I don't think with this dress it's really terrible because it doesn't have like a train or anything. It's just a dress. And normally if you wear a dress, it doesn't hit the floor because then you would fall and you cannot walk outside, it would get dirty. So, but then I wouldn't have my clients wear like heels and shoes on my backgrounds because then I will get like black lines on my back drop. It can even tear. So it's usually barefoot, which I really like as well. It matches the style. I wouldn't photograph just up until your knee or something. Of course, you don't notice the feet at all. It's very pretty. Um, I really like the romantic feel of this dress and I like the color as well. Another package, woman dress, uh, value three dollars, mm -mm. anyway, I'll put the screenshot there, Ooh. look, I did order some other colors as well, so here we have a burgund burgundy probably, that's how you call it, dark red, dark pink, Somewhere in between, sorry for the scrunchiness. Uh, so this is like a trico material. It's a little bit darker than it shows on the screen. On the screen it's really bright, but it's more like a Bordeaux red, burgundy red. Uh, so let's see, here we go. Okay, ooh, I like this. Okay, so it has like off the shoulder uh, sleeves and I think I have to iron it. It does, it has like a seam underneath the breast area um, and then in the back it's a little bit longer than in the front so like a train also this might be just a tiny bit too short for me so I'm just gonna dive into it yeah I mean you probably get like makeup on your dresses so wash them regularly I think you should be fine washing them maybe even washing them by hand like the lace ones if you're afraid the material is gonna get ruined so I think this is like a Beautiful off shoulder. So again, I'm going to hide my own straps. So off shoulder, even if they have their own bra on, just put the straps inside, like I did. Okay, then here, we've got the belly area. My belly, beautiful belly. Um, this one is very pretty. Um, photographed like this, like this. Very beautiful. Lovely material. It's kind of like a thin t-shirt material, so it feels really um, comfortable. But now I'm going to show you the bottom. Um, again, too short for me. It would have been nice if it would like hit the floor. Now you can see, like, see my toes. Um, so yeah, maybe you can even tell your moms to paint their toenails in a burgundy red, maybe, if they like that color. Uh, but what I love with, it, with this dress, it does have like a train. But then it would have been prettier if it would like hit the floor and then you would have the train. Ooh, almost losing my belly here. Um, so yeah, like this, but I'm just too tall for this. I mean, the dresses are from China. Probably the women are a little bit shorter. So yeah, I'm Dutch, I'm tall. Uh, most women are a little bit shorter than I am. In Asia, they're usually smaller than I am. So it makes sense that the dresses are shorter. So that's why I was really happy that the first two dresses were long enough. This one is still very pretty to use, but you can just tell your clients when they're picking out dresses that this one does not hit the floor. It's pretty, I love the color. Cause um, I don't have anything yet in this color, so it's gonna look nice uh, as an addition to the ones I already have for the women to choose from. So it's pretty dress, very soft material, stretchy. It's not super thin, thin it's not super thick. Um, well sewn, sewn, sewn well, sewn well. Um, yeah, I mean, you can see it's not a dress 
that costs a hundred dollars um, but it's I think nice for a shoot okay so two more packages clients could be here any minute uh, but they're not here yet so I'll just continue this says uh, women dress value thirteen dollars and twenty nine cents I think that makes sense I have another dress in this burgun burgundy red yeah, the camera is giving me a signal that the battery is almost empty. Ooh, this is pretty. Ooh, I like the fabric. Uh, so this feels like a chiffon dress and then lace sleeves. And it's lined as well in the front and in the back. Like starting here and then going down. So here it is. Again, it could have been a little bit longer. But it's still very pretty. And uh, you can tie it in the back with like a ribbon. Um, this is a size doesn't say but I'll put it in the screen uh, it looks very pretty because the lace is like stretchy and sewn well good quality and then the skirt is like a chiffon and you have this beautiful ribbon uh, that you can tie in the back so I'm just gonna stand up Ooh. stand up okay this one I would have loved it if it would like hit the floor um, so for short women Beautiful, it will hit the floor. For tall women, it's uh, just a little bit too short. So it's like lined up to here, which is good. Um, and then when you pose, like you can have one arm here, one hand here, but it's just a little bit too short for me. You can stand like this, looking at the camera, looking at the belly. Looking very cute over the shoulder to the floor. I have a little wind machine blowing in the hair. Looking like this, down to the belly. My hair is going crazy now. Looking down to the belly, looking up. Very cute dress. I love this color. Hmm, look here. There's a zipper on the side as well. So you can open up the zipper. Uh, but it's actually really stretchy if you wear it. Um, so I didn't need to I didn't need to use the zipper, but there's a zipper on the side as well. So very high quality. So yeah. Now I have two of these like burgundy bordeaux red dresses so the women can choose them. They're not completely falling on the floor. Um, but what do you expect for that amount? Okay, last package. I hope my camera doesn't stop filming. Oh yes, I think this one's really pretty. It's not a maternity dress. It's actually a dress, sorry, it's actually a dress that my daughter could wear. Um, it's just a beautiful dress uh, to have here in the studio for little girls who come with their moms for a maternity session, for little girls who come to a newborn session with their baby brother or baby sister, and they are going to be in the photo as well. It's size 120. It looks a little bit smaller than that because my daughter usually wears 110 to 116 right now. She's five. And I think this will be very short on her, uh, but with leggings, um, it should be fine or like, yeah, something like that. It's very pretty. If you see it up close, it's kind of like white, off-white, and it has polka dots uh, pattern sewn onto it. Here's the back. It closes with a little button. It has like longer sleeves and the whole dress is pretty see-through. So maybe like it's white spaghetti top and then like white leggings. Uh, would be super cute so I might have my daughter wear this for Christmas or something and then I'm gonna keep it in the studio to use for the little girls I've just taken out my belly and I thought I would just show you that these dresses can also be really pretty during regular photo sessions like when you're not pregnant so maybe even when you have a mom coming in for a newborn session uh, with her little baby and she wants to be in the photo with her baby and she didn't bring any like tops or t-shirts to use or dresses for the photos with her newborn. I mean, you can offer that she wears one of these dresses. Very simple, very uh, cute, and uh, also cute without a belly. Mm. So yeah, it's always difficult to determine, like, is it okay to buy from AliExpress? But then they are little business owners. They are little businesses uh, trying to earn an income by creating these dresses and they communicate really well with you. They want you to be satisfied. Uh, they love it when you give feedback, when you upload photos of the products that you got. Um, I feel like they are happy running a little business and providing for their family. 
Um, so is it wrong to buy from them? I don't know. If you see that they are really copying designs from other maternity dress designers and they are even like using their photos, stealing their photos and claiming that the photos are of their products, which they're clearly not, um, then I think it's a different story. Just because also you have no idea what you're gonna get because the product is not gonna be similar to the one that you see in the photo because they stole the photo from someone else's website who is the actual designer of that model. Um, so yeah, maybe in the future I will buy some Mia Stilo dresses again, like with the big tool in the bottom. Uh, they're really pretty, um, but then I will go to her. Uh, but with these kind of dresses, um, just because some dresses are made here in the Netherlands and they're really good and really uh, unique doesn't mean that I can not buy another type of dress from another vendor uh, which doesn't even remotely look like her dresses um, but yeah what do you do do you use products from Aliexpress let me know in the comments thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed it please like subscribe and leave a comment I'd love to read your comments um, and then um, maybe you can see me in my next video and I can see you in the comment section so that would be cool Thank you so much for watching, have a lovely day or evening depending on where you are, um, so yeah, bye bye.